Hello, fellow traders. Nutty Bar Trading coming to you. It is a Friday, and uh, this is a recap on how the trading went today. Uh, I need to keep this kind of brief. I am running behind. Um, so let's just dive right in. Um, it wasn't good on my 150K, man. I just, it just, oh, it makes my cringe thinking about how my day went. I'm going to quickly go over it just to kind of, I don't know explain my thought process but again it's it's just the theme of this account it feels like we get shot in the tick so many times it's actually no longer funny it is no longer anything funny about it it's actually very frustrating um again got shot in the tick right here and it just kind of just uh, put me a little bit on tilt um ended up just taking some losses and this this here was me just chasing chasing a bad trade i just i'm not trading well um on this account either so i definitely have no no excuses but then the, the final nail in the coffin today was right here uh i became a little bit too biased i was you know all of a sudden i kind of get it in my mind to where i'm like okay we're going to test the overnight lows. That was my theory. Um, I was actually bullish all day. And then finally, after this big sell-off, I'm like, okay, fine. We were kind of, this EMA was holding up. I thought, okay, fine. Maybe we'll go test the lows of the overnight session. And I just kind of got married to that. And I wasn't willing to get off of that bias. And it's always trouble. I shorted as soon as we got to the EMA we did hit my initial profit target, and then the runner, it just started ripping against me, and I decided that I'm not getting shot in the tick again, and I moved my stop above these highs, which is a really big stop, and we almost, we, we held through some pretty major drawdown here, and the price actually did finally, after much pain and suffering, the price actually did finally come down. It gave me an opportunity to get out at a profit, and I was too, I was a little bit too stubborn. I was too stubborn to take my profit. So uh, I just sat here and watched it rip against me and stop me out, and it is what it is. I was kind of pot committed at that point, but it was just, it was a, it, it is what it is. And you know what? It just is what it is, but. That is how the 150K was today. That account is now at 150,597.50. We have about 2,900 in drawdown left. So there's plenty of wiggle room. There's plenty of, we have plenty of wiggle room to recover still, but it's just kind of frustrating how it was, how it's been going the last couple of days on this account. So hopefully we can turn it around next week. Now let's move to and talk about some good news and let's talk about the 50Ks. So, 50Ks, here we go. Again, had a good day today. It wasn't without some issues. Um, I definitely did not trade to, as well today on this on these accounts either. And again, toward the end of the day, after kind of my debacle with the 150K account, um, it wasn't at the end of the day, but it was when I got stopped out by one tick. Um, that kind of affected me a little bit on my 50Ks, and I was actually, I, I'm going to say I was lucky. Um, I was twice, I was really, really close to getting, to hitting my max loss on an account for, a, I was very close to a $600 loss, which is my max loss on these accounts, so, but it turned around and actually ended up hitting my profit target. So feel a feel kind of lucky with that. Now, these four accounts here, um, that that was kind of sad. And I so those accounts were I forget how much, but some of those were up three hundred dollars plus at one point in the day. And I should have, I don't know, this is hindsight, but it was, you know, I was, I kept trading them and I gave back all that profit I had in those. Um, but I was actually at one point up close to on total on my 50K accounts, 
I was really close to uh, being up 4,000 in profit total. <clears throat> Excuse me. So I think it was like 3,900 and I let that affect me a little bit. So that's definitely a mistake. And uh, I was trying to get to that 4K profit and... Uh, these four accounts kind of suffered from it. I ended up giving all the profits back in these four accounts. And uh, until I finally was like, okay, if I don't stop now, I'm going to get a max loss. I'm going to take one of these to 600 negative. And so I, I did. I, I stopped and ended the day um, 2.4K in profit. So I'm still happy with it. No, I'm not complaining. Um, had an absolutely insane week. Um, just this week alone, we have eleven thousand eight hundred dollar profit in these fifty k accounts. So, just really loving the progress, I guess, that I'm making. So, hopefully, we can continue. And uh, keep it going. But there were definitely some red flags today on how I'm trading that I just need to be careful. And again, like I said, I kind of cycle through the accounts. And each time I go bigger size. And the last round, I was actually trading one mini contract. And a little bit... I don't, I don't think I'm quite ready for that yet. So I might reevaluate my sizing. Uh, and maybe not scale up quite as fast on those so definitely some things to watch out for and uh, just to not go too crazy i guess but overall very happy with the 50ks hopefully we can keep this going next week um obviously you can see here our account balances we have um one account balance at 1500 in profit and then we've got three of them 1300 in profit two of them 1200 in profit and then we have what is it? Six accounts, 1100 in profit, and then two, 1000 in profit, and then eight, and then kind of rounding out the bottom here. So, hope we can keep it up. But uh, actually, here, let me quickly show you my the 150K account here is again, these two. We had a bad day last Tuesday, and then we recovered. You can, here, let me show the full month. Mm. You know, then we recovered, and uh, now we've given all that back. So it's kind of sad how that account is going. But again, we'll be back at it Monday, and hopefully we can recover this, and uh, hopefully we can keep it going on to 50K. So that's it. Take care. Hope everyone has a great weekend, and uh, God bless.